Importing a letter into Best Practice is really quite simple. To start, open up your word processor from the main menu of Best Practice. From here, you could create or modify your own templates. We won't be doing that today. Instead, we'll simply be importing an already created template. To do this, go up to the Templates menu and select Import Template. Browse through your computer to find where you've saved the rich text format document or the RTF file that you use for your template. In my case, I've saved it to the desktop. And then just open up the file. Now as you can see, it's sort of loaded up your template without any of the data or information that comes with a patient's file. To actually use this template in best practice, you need to go back to your templates menu and select Use Template. Name the template. And click Save. As you can see now, if we scroll down, the template we've just saved is now available for us to use. In this case, we won't open it up straight yet. We'll just click Cancel. We'll exit out of the letter writer and open up a patient's file. Now from here, we can actually use the template we've just loaded from the word processor or new letter option. So open up a new letter, click Templates, Use Template, and scroll down to the template you've just loaded. As you can see, it's here. As you can see, this is our final letter, filled in with all the details that come with the template. To make better use of templates that you use often, you could add them to your favorites list down in this left hand corner. To add a template to your favorite list, click Add. Scroll through your templates for the template to add. And click Add again on this button here. Now, in the future, instead of going Templates, Use Templates, you can simply click on this and load up a new template.